First off, uh, what does it mean to wear the shirt you unified in history? Go ahead. You go first. Well, <laughs> um, it means a lot. I think it carries, I don't know, a lot of weight and it sends an important message. Um, it just shows exactly what we stand for uh, and what we find important. Um, our, our team is so diverse that it just, it just brings us together also. Mm -hmm. And just like, it just tells people that we, um, <laughs> that we stand for something. How, how do you feel that the community and, and public take shirts like that? I, I, I think it's a second thought, you know, yeah. um, I, I don't think people, you know, um, what am I trying to say here? It's not like the first, you know, like it's it's been Black History Month for what thirteen days now, and yeah. um, and we, I haven't heard anything f like from pretty much anybody from the college, <laughs> um, supporting the black athletes, nothing at all, like no like like events or anything, just I know like the student did some like some quiz stuff, but that's pretty much all I've heard about Black History Month. Yeah. Um, so yeah, I think, you know, they, the public appreciates what we're doing, you know, trying to send a message. But yeah, I do think that, you know, it's all oh, good for them. But um, in terms of taking action, uh, I still think we're a little slow. And it's not just here in Fort McMurray, it's everywhere. Yeah. Okay, last question for you. So being young black athletes at Keanu College, what's the lasting impression you want to leave? That it's possible. It's yeah. possible to be a black athlete and be successful. Um, you know, it's possible to play post-secondary school, get your education, and also do something that you love um, in addition to it. Um, just grind never stops. Yeah. Always work hard. Yeah, and there's going to be a lot of obstacles in your way, and you just have to, like, you just have to push through that. Mm -hmm. Awesome. Thanks, guys.